Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the Epiphany Tuesday concert series. My name is Jin Sun Cho. I'm the director of music at the Church of the Epiphany in Washington, D.C. On behalf of Reverend Glenna Schubert, our staffs, and Epiphany family, I am very excited to announce that our Tuesday concerts are returning virtually. So now you can enjoy wonderful music every Tuesday anywhere you are during this pandemic. For more information about our concert program, please visit our website at epiphanydc.org and please don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your continuous support and for being with us today. Now, please welcome the U.S. Army String Quartet. Thank you. 
Thank you very much for joining us today. Uh, the first piece was called Sky Life, made famous by the Turtle Island String Quartet, composed by one of its members, David Balakrishna. Um, you could hear that's maybe a little unexpected for String Quartet. It had lots of rap, rock, jazz, and blues influences, and we got to use our instruments in new ways that we're not used to. Um, you could hear Sergei playing a lot of chopping technique, which we use for this kind of music. The next piece is decidedly very string quartet by Haydn, uh, the guy who invented the string quartet, essentially, at least as we know it. Um, this is the first movement of the quartet nicknamed The Bird, and you'll hear Jordan playing some sounds throughout that sound rather bird-like, and it's a very fun thing.
Thank you. 
we need to take a quick chance to introduce everybody here today. On violin, we have Staff Sergeant Ward Appendy and Staff Sergeant Sergei Prokofiev. And on cello, we've already heard from the Staff Sergeant Aaron Ludwig, and I am Master Sergeant Colin Waters. And um, like she said in our introduction, we are um, the U.S. Army String Quartet. We are part of a large ensemble called the United States Army Strings, and that's a group of 21 people, uh, which is part of the greater uh, United States Army Band, so it's located in Fort Myer, Virginia. So our primary duty is to play functions here in the Washington, D.C. area, uh, mostly military government functions at the highest level. And um, moving on to introduce our next two pieces, the next song we'll be doing is called Fort of Chicken Dark, and it is from an album called Go Rudy, Go Rodeo. Um, that album was done by four musicians, Stuart Duncan on fiddle, Chris Neal on mandolin, Yo-Yo Ma on cello, and Edgar Meyer on bass. Um, so a really interesting combination of instruments, and the reason they call it Go Rodeo, I read, is it's um, an aviation term, and it's meant to mean that a hundred things have to go right in order to make this thing happen. So these musicians came together, and it took you know, everything going right to pull them together to be able to record this album. Um, and they wrote all of the songs on it. So Quarter Chicken Dark is this really cool um, fiddle song, and our own Staff Sergeant Sergei Prokofiev did the arrangement of this piece, so he adapted the instruments that it was originally written for um, for string quartet. So I think you'll really enjoy the adaptation of that. And then following that piece, um, we'll be doing a song called Gabriel's Oboe. That's written by Ennio Morricone. Uh, he's a film composer who's very famous, and Gabriel's Oboe was written for a movie called The Mission um, that had Bruce Willis and Jeremy Irons and Liam Neeson in it. Um, it's a beautiful melody, and the reason we're playing it today is because the composer passed away a few months ago. We thought it would be a nice tribute to him to do this. It's also a really popular song nowadays for weddings, so it might sound familiar to our audience members out there. So we hope you enjoy our next two songs. Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you. 
been doing it for many years, and this is the first time it's virtual, but we are happy to be here as part of that. Uh, as well, I would like to thank um, Colonel Andrew Esch um, from the Army Band for allowing us to come here. And um, also, for those people who are tuning in, I'd like to invite you to visit the United States Army Band webpage at usarmyband.com and to check out our YouTube channel and subscribe, as well as uh, Facebook and Instagram. You can find us on all of those platforms. And finally, to finish up, you've heard throughout we've done movements of the Heidelberg Quartet, and we'll be playing the finale from that quartet. And you will hear lots of bird sounds. This is especially close to uh, my heart right now because my 12-year-old son is really, really into birds, and we hear all kinds of videos at home of birds all the time, all different bird sounds, so when I listen to this piece, I hear all of those bird sounds coming out, so this one uh, speaks to me as the cuckoo, but you know, you can listen to it and decide what kind of bird that is to you, but this is our uh, finale, which is the presto from the Heidelberg Quartet. Thank you all so much for tuning in, and uh, hope you come back next week for the Tuesday concert. Thank you. 